fish on. Nice. So I've been fishing this river for, a, for an hour or so now and the rain's been on and off for most of it but it has just cleared up a little bit um, but we are expecting some pretty heavy rain tonight um, starting from this evening so I am pretty keen to get where I'm heading to set up camp and I'm just going to follow this river along now uh, and eventually it meets into a lock and in that lock there's um, a few beaches which I'm hoping to set up camp I say to, to stay there tonight but yeah some beautiful little spots here to fish so I'm just picking away at them as I go along and hopefully we'll say we'll get to that locking in good time and get camp set up before the rain comes over. So I'm back out in my Z-Pax 3 Duo tent on this trip, extremely lightweight tent and uh, yeah it's perfect for these sort of trips where I'm hiking in long distances, difficult terrain, I'm trying to keep my backpack weight down, but yeah it's been a while since I've been out on it so looking forward to getting it up uh, and yeah spend the night in here. So the tent's all set up, I've had to use a few rocks in places just to keep the pegs nice and secure in the sand uh, and, and yeah, pretty happy with the pitch and got some nice views from the tent door right across the lock here and yeah, got me a nice place to spend the night. I have just checked the weather forecast and um, yeah, it's looking like about midnight tonight, some strong wind gusts coming over and also there's a yellow one of rain in place now so it's definitely going to be a, wa um, a wet hike on the way out tomorrow um, but we'll just see how we get on with that. But yeah, the tent's all set up, I've got all my sleeping gear in there and what I'm going to do now is hike into the forest here, see if I can find some dead standing wood, bring that down to the beach and then we can have, hopefully have a nice contained fire in my bush box tonight for cooking up some food.
So it's pretty slim pickings for the firewood round here. I did manage to find a little bit on the edge of the forest there, thankfully. Um, but yeah, it's quite damp. But I brought it back to camp, split it down the best I can, and hopefully this wind, a uh, bit of sunshine, will hopefully dry it out a little bit more. And we'll be able to use that for having a fire tonight. But yeah, I'm going to grab the rod now, head to the other side of the lock here, uh, and see if we can do a bit of fishing. So yeah, no luck with the fish unfortunately. I was thinking about keeping that fish I caught earlier on this morning, um, but I knew I had quite a long way to hike still and um, I wasn't exactly sure where I'd end up camping. And um, yeah, I didn't think I'd, it'd last all day to be honest in my backpack. So I just decided to throw it back, uh, thinking I might get into a few more fish when I got here. Um, but yeah, as it turns out, it hasn't happened. So yeah, I got a pretty simple meal to cook tonight. I'm quite hungry now, so I'm looking forward to getting the bush box lit, get the campfire going and then yeah, cook up some tea. And yeah, I've just changed it some dry clothes as well, put my down jacket on, it's quite cold in that wind, so just been chilling in the tent, taking a bit of a, a bit of a break from, from the wind blowing across. But like I said, I'm pretty keen to get a campfire lit, uh, yeah, and get some food cooked up. So I kept it pretty simple on this trip food wise, wanted to keep it lightweight as well and I was hoping to get in some fish, uh, but yeah that hasn't turned out so I've decided tonight I'll just cook up my lunch and dinner together, I didn't stop at all today on the hike in and I had a, um, some noodles which I was going to cook up, but so I didn't stop so I decided to just chuck those in with my pasta tonight as well. But yeah, mixing them together, pretty tasty considering it looks a bit of a mess, uh, but yeah I'm quite hungry so I'm going to sit now and enjoy this.
Right, so I've just been fishing my tea off and um, washed my cooking pot and got a few bits of gear sorted and now I've just boiled up some water for a nice cup of coffee. It's actually turned into a pretty nice evening. But yeah, there's clouds building in every direction, so it looks like the bad the weather is, is definitely heading towards us and and yeah, it's probably not gonna be too far away to be honest. But yeah, I'm gonna finish this coffee off, just enjoy what I can out here and then get in the tent and call it the night. So it's a pretty wild morning out there today. It's been raining pretty heavy for most of the night with some uh, really strong wind gusts as well at times. But yeah, it's been nice just to lay in my sleeping bag, nice and warm and comfortable. Looking out under the tent door, watching the rain come down. Uh, and yeah, pretty keen for a cup of coffee, so I've just, just decided to get my stove out there and boil up some water in the tent doorway. But this morning I have found a pretty, a pretty decent puddle right next to where I was laying in the tent. Um, so I haven't got a clue where that's coming from. I've been trying to find the leak from somewhere, but I can't figure out where it's coming from. So it's quite a big size puddle. And um, yeah, I'm going to have to try and fix that uh, before I bring this tent out again. But yeah, as you can probably hear, it's still, it's still raining. And it's, it's setting for most of the day now, checking the weather forecast again this morning. Um, so I'm going to finish this coffee off. I'm not going to hang about too long. I'm just going to get this, finish this cup of coffee get everything packed away inside the tent that I can uh, and make the long hike back out to where I've left the car. So the tent's all packed up, backpack's loaded, ready to go. I'm just going to finish the video off here by saying thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate it as always, and if you did like it, please consider hitting that thumbs up button for me. But yeah, appreciate all your continued support. Uh, anyone that's new to the channel and you like the content, please consider hitting that subscribe button for me as well. But yeah, that's it for me on this one. Thanks a lot for watching guys, and I hope to see you on the next video.